Hey everyone, I'm Dustin. I have nearly 20 years experience in the bike and e-bike industry and today I'm going to show you the most comfortable tricycle seat for heavier adult riders. Stick around. All right, so today I'm going to show you the most comfortable tricycle seat for heavier adult riders. But before I do, hit subscribe below, stay in touch with us here at 630, be the first to know about all the new content we're putting out, giveaways we do, and of course, new product releases. All right, so let's say you're a tricycle rider and you're looking for the ultimate comfort seat, something that's gonna really cradle your rear and be comfortable for the rides that you wanna do. I've got the seat behind me, and I know a lot of trike riders are looking for something that's gonna be ultra, ultra comfortable. And let me introduce you to the Super Max Cush seat from 630. Now, I also have the 630 tricycles right, our e-tricycles right here, our Every Journey electric trike, and our Easy Transit folding trike. And we have two versions of the Super Max Cush seat here, one without the backrest and one with the backrest. And I have my two riders here today. I have Stella, who is five foot seven, 250 pounds, and Arden, who's five foot 10, 300 pounds. And we're gonna show you how much support the Super Max Cush seat gives and why it is really the most comfortable seat for tricycle riders, especially if you're a little bit heavier. Now, let me just go ahead and show you this on camera. This seat is 14 and a half inches wide. And to give you a sense, our 630 saddle, which is already an oversized wide seat, is nine and a half inches. So this is five inches wider than that. And when you look at the marketplace, a lot of seats are very narrow. Uh, racing saddles are gonna be, you know, three, four inches wide. So if you look at me holding this up, you can really see the width here. This is gonna give you a lot of surface area, really cradle your rear and really feel very, very nice. And especially if you like to ride every day and go out for longer rides, this is gonna feel like a sofa seat, but still allow you to pedal. So let me go ahead and put this back on. So like I said, 14 and a half inches wide, gives you a lot of surface area. And let's go ahead and get this all locked in. Okay, so let's have Arden, why don't you go ahead and get on here. Sure. We'll have you demonstrate, see how you like it. Ever ridden an electric tricycle before? No, it's the first time. Okay. All right, so it's gonna steer a little bit different than a regular bike. Okay. Uh, but you're all locked in and ready to go. Make the same loop. How's the seat feel? It's very, very comfortable. And go ahead and park with the front of the tire right here. Got it. And I want to show you guys now a lot of seats, they don't accommodate an individual that may like a wider seat or need a wider seat. Now you can see with Arden here, it really gets to the width of his rear and it cradles it. So he doesn't have any of his leg or his hip spilling over the side and cutting into his body. And this makes it feel ultra comfortable also has the a little bit of uprise on the edges which gives him that added support on the sides as well and do you feel restricted at all when pedaling or does it feel really comfortable it's very comfortable cool all right let's go ahead and park actually you can just go ahead and leave it here Got it. stella do you want to come on and hop on then too now have you ridden the trike before yes yes okay a year ago. Oh <laughs> we can lower the seat if you need oh, no. How's that feel? Good. All right, so go ahead and take a lap and then, or actually before you go, let me pull you back here. So same with Stella. Uh, go ahead and grab the brakes so you don't go anywhere. Okay. You can see how much width it gives her and how it really gives her that added support. Now imagine if she was on a seat that was five inches narrower. We actually have another video with Stella detailing this seat as well if you wanna check it out. And she does some smaller seats, but you can see how this gives her uh, great support and it feels comfortable. Does it feel comfortable? I should ask you. This feels comfortable. Cool. I feel supported. Okay, so go ahead and take a lap around. 
just just don't be afraid to turn it'll balance it's a little bit different than the bike it's hard to transition from bike to trike And I only have you guys in level one too, so Ooh. just for control purposes. <laughs> wait, wait. Sorry, you can wait. get off there if so you want. More. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, just remember don't be afraid to steer. Okay. Okay. That's the one thing with tricycles. Okay. Beautiful. You can get off there and then we'll, we'll move to Art. If you want to go get. Mounted up on that. You might want the seat up a little higher. I don't know how that will feel for you. Okay. I'll go ahead and park cool. this one. Okay. Yeah, let me raise the seat up for you. All right. Okay. Just a little quick release right here. Okay, so now, if you're somebody that wants even more relaxed sensation, go ahead and try that, and you want that lower back support, same super max cush, same width, but with the backrest. Okay, so go ahead and take it for a lap. You can see we got the back support here. And you can see he can lean back, he's got that support, very comfortable. And go ahead and park facing the camera, or the back facing the camera. Oh. All right, so you can see he's got the backrest here. And if we wanted to, lean forward just a little bit. Sure. Uh, so in this case, this is as high, we have it as high as it will go, but he could bring it down if he wanted more lower support. Uh, we can find, I think he likes it up here, but we can find that perfect height for him. Go ahead and tighten it in. And how do you like between the backrest and the non-backrest? It's nice to have it. So, I mean, it's super comfortable um, on the other on the other saddle without it, but for the longer rides and uh, the fact that it actually is an option, it's nice to have. There you go. Yeah. So yeah, gives that little bit of support. You can relax a little bit more on the rides. Nice to have. All right, Stella, your turn. Okay, and where do you like, is that good height-wise or do you want it lower? No, this is good. That's good, okay. So same thing, you can see she's getting that support there. Just helping keep the posture a little bit better. You know, make sure you don't have a experience as much back soreness on long rides. She's getting that great support. So go ahead, yeah, take a lap. <laughs> and then just stay away from the cars. There you go. I like that it's helping me to sit up straight. Yeah? Yeah. Well, you have really great, you can see from the side angle here, if you park right there a sec, you can see how nicely upright she is and like with the, with the handlebar position as well right there. Does this feel really comfortable all yeah. in all? Yeah. Yeah, the I'm easy transits are great. It just, it's like it's making me sit up straight. Yeah. The backrest is like the icing on the cake. <laughs> cool. Well, there you go. You can get off if you like. So it's a great seat for a trike rider, especially both our riders love the backrest. You have the option, again, 14 and a half inch wide seat. Uh, that backrest is gonna give you added support. And don't forget, this is the 630 Easy Transit folding trike, 750 watt front hub, and our Every Journey 250 watt, two great trike options as well. So if you're interested in this seat, find it on our 630, on 630.com. If you have any other questions, comment below. Email us at team at 630.com or call us 310-982-2877. Also, if you want to hear how other people like that seat in advance of purchasing, check out the Facebook Peddlers group, ask questions, see how they like it before you buy. 
So thank you for sticking around and don't forget, it's your journey, your experience, enjoy the ride.